Guys, it is Cedaholic, and I'm trying to get the light out of the shop, but I want you to know what I did. I bought some oregano, so I got it sunk in a pot, and the big bad heat finished it. Look at it, isn't it gorgeous? Can you see that? This one is four foot wide by ten foot long. Right now, he is putting in some butter crunch lettuce seed tape that I'd forgotten I had. Don't laugh at me, you guys know I'm a Cedaholic. There's a reason I have this name. And we transplanted all our little beet seedlings, and I'm so excited because I don't know if I can get close enough, but can you see that that one's yellow? This one is pink, and this one is dark red. And those are three different types. It's Detroit Dark Red, Golden Beet, and Chagias. And this is my winter density lettuce. I showed you the seed packet from Baker Creek had said that it was overpacked due to poor germination but it seems to have worked for me just fine i got three gorgeous heads going there that we're planting in the bed and then there's another pot let me stand up and take it a little closer um on this end and this is just regular italian oregano in this pot surrounded by pretty petunias and then if you look very closely at the edge of the bed we've got marigolds the entire border on all three sides the back row here is empty because i'm going to put pole beans here and as things move out of the way i'll have a trellis up and there'll be vining squash and pumpkin coming out of my winter sewing jugs which are still over there covered because it's chilly today this is all that romaine that was up front and another little bed he built me i told you about this one's the two by ten uh two by twelve or th th two by fourteen i'm sorry these are all romaine and then here's this gorgeous spinach, and I've got it kind of covered a little bit to help keep the rabbits and other things out of it. Then I've got a few beets stuck in here because I have a little extra room. Then, at the end of this bed, if I don't fall and kill myself, probably that would go viral, please don't laugh, I've got time to replace the one I lost. And I've got more radishes coming up. You guys know I like radishes. And there are some carrot seeds interspersed among here. And one more marigold here. So, that was my quickie video of the day. A lot of my little seedlings in the cups are uh, very dry. So I'm going to try and rescue them and water them and see if we can um, rescue them and get them planted somewhere quickly. He's going to build another bed this size over where you see those stacks of hay, which I bought thinking I was going to do the root stout method of potato planting this year, but I cannot because turns out Joshua and I are highly allergic to it. Both of us were wheezing and gasping for breath, so I'll have to figure something else for my potatoes. Anyways, just wanted to show you what we got growing on and wish you as always happy gardening and blessings of bounty to you and yours in this gardening season. Until next time, guys.